Welcome back to Spiritual Soul. Well, today I figure we'll talk about our inspiration for the week in our spiritual scripture while I make some coffee because my nerves bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, how is everyone? And I hope your week is going good. So, before I get started with my filming because I usually film on Saturdays I do at least two or three videos sure do so before I put lashes on and put on lipstick depending on what I have going on I figured I come up and do my next inspiration while I'm waiting for my coffee so see, I'm really not gonna keep you. So while that's warming up, let's do our cards. I hope you have your inspiration board. And if you're new, thank you for clicking on this channel. I am Ages How You Wear It. And on Wednesdays, every other Wednesday, I do my spiritual soul, where we talk about Bible verses. Um, if you are like me and you really don't go to a church but you still want to read your word and you still want to make sure that you are taking care of your inside which is your soul which is your spirit and making sure so for me i am a christian so i don't like titles i'm a christian mm, i don't like I believe in a higher power. So for me, I believe in a higher power. So I make sure that I put my God's word in my soul. So let's talk about our our um, inspiration. What I'm putting on my inspiration board this week while my coffee pot is heating up. Okay, so the first thing I chose, look at that. Don't we want the world to open up? Don't we want to get out there? Uh, I am an introvert with a splash. What old people say? I'm talking about older people because I'm already old. But what the older generation before my old generation said, a splash or something. Well, I'm a splash of an uh, extrovert. Okay? So I've noticed that. I like to be alone when I want to be alone. And then when I don't want to, that's when I want to be around people. It's just that simple. Okay, so my first uh, inspiration card says, To those searching for love, the universe has created someone who has missed you for a very long time. You are this person's dream love. So you might have missed your love. Because, you know, we got this thing where if they ain't tall enough, short enough, if they don't look this way, if they don't make this money, or we have all these criterias and the person that is meant for us walk right on past us because I'm not looking your way, buddy. You don't meet my criteria. So I'm starting to brew. So this is signifying that you need to sit back and wait because take down your notches a little bit. So if it hasn't worked for you so far, what makes you think all these criteria you're looking for is, is that who God has meant for you? But hey, keep stepping in the way. That's your business. Keep stepping in the way. I pulled that card because I can't, I, I'm not saying that I don't ever want to get married again and uh, well, I don't. See, I, I, I don't. But if I am walking in God's plan, then I don't know. So I threw it out there. So this week is all about relationships. This week is all about those who are out there and maybe you are searching for love, right? Maybe you are one of those people out there searching for love. And, you know, I want to give you something to inspire to as well. Because this channel is all about what we do for each other and what you need to do for you best relationships are born when you 
best relationships are born when we are not looking for them because they don't come from a feeling of need. So, it's kind of light when I see it up to, um, it's kind of light. I don't know about that. I might have to add another one. See these coffees with all this flavoring in it, you know, and that's all I have right now. Oh, you know what? That's all I have right now. So sometimes this coffee be looking a little um, light. I'm gonna have to add some darker. I got my Dunkin' iced coffee. It's still coffee, it just say you can you know, it's, you can make it cold. So now, I think I might have to make me some cold coffee because I had to add some more coffee to that because that was too light. So I'm going to put this in the refrigerator for a little bit. means I'm gonna have to change from this oat milk which I put in um, when I'm making hot coffee I don't put this in when I'm doing cold when I'm doing cold coffee I put in a natural bliss I don't know it just tastes better all right so what is this card saying it's saying and it's got a picture of all different colors nationalities different people so what it's telling you is maybe if you start being needy you know some people oh i gotta have a child and be married at a certain age oh i i gotta hurry up and get a boyfriend oh we broke up so now i need to replace you with no and none of the relationships last because we doing it out of need sit back Find out from your inner self. You remember I always talk about self-reflection. Find out why it is that you can't stay in a long-term relationship. Stop thinking about what they did or didn't do. What did you do or didn't do? Because the, the thing is, what, what have you brought into the relationship? Maybe that's the problem. We got to think that sometimes we may be the problem. I know a lot of people don't want to face that and don't want to talk about that, but you have to self-reflect or you'll keep going through this over and over again. All right. So the next card says, when you start to grow in one area of your life, other areas improve right along with it. Write a dream so ambitious that if you achieved it, it will blow your mind. You don't need to know how you are going to make it happen in advance so think about your past okay some of the things that you have achieved was it easy now you walk through it and at the moment when it was happening it may have seemed like oh my god this is the hardest thing ever i cannot do this but you got through it or anything you've improved on so when you walk through it it improves something about you would improve something about your life so this says make your dream way above what you would ever expect to get because you're going you're worth it and you may get it stop lowering yourself to say well yeah well if i could just find me an apartment i'll be fine what what about if i can buy me a house so everything those my inspiration board for this week is about love self-reflection and if god is meant for me to have someone in my life he will put that person in my life but until then i can't make it hard okay i'm going against you he bring the person in, in your life he it, you know female male i don't know who's going to come upon this video but what if that person you not looking at that person because 
of all the criteria you put on what you want instead of maybe what God wants in your life. Okay. So, let me get some ice in my coffee before we do the scripture. Because remember, I have started off with making hot coffee. So in order to make it cold coffee, I'm going to have to put some, some cubes in there. There we go. And it's popping in everything. The fruit of the spirit. What? What is that? Okay. The fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, long suffering, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self control. So we're doing Galatians five twenty two twenty three. First of all, oh boy. I know you've heard this. So it is called the fruit of the spirit. Not the fruits. Let's make sure we remember that. It's called the fruit of the spirit. And what that means is you have to have all of these. You can't have love but no joy. How can you have love but no joy? So you say you're in love or you love someone but you don't feel no joy from that relationship or that person so you don't feel no joy but you love no let me let me really let me read again what the scripture says the fruit of the spirit in order for you to have this relationship with God any relationship in your life anything that's in your soul see I'm talking about you not the other person you if you do not feel love along with joy along with peace So you got to feel it together. The long suffering. Okay, so the long suffering. That doesn't mean somebody's poking you and you're getting tortured. That's not what long suffering means. It means that we can't go out and do all the things that we find. We can't go. Okay, this is, let me give you an example. You are a. You call yourself a Christian man. But you go to the strip club with your homeboys and you lust. So your long suffering is if that's what you enjoyed before you became a Christian. But then you gave yourself to the Lord and you want to walk a certain path. Then the long suffering is giving up the things that are not good for you that are sinful and to us humans that is long suffering i can't have that oreo cookie long suffering i can't eat those chips long suffering i can't go gamble all my money and don't have rent long suffering see you got the what's long suffering so you think oh my god to become a christian i gotta suffer all the time and every day no see that's your interpretation. I'm telling you mine. So I feel love, joy, peace. You remember that prayer we did last week? When I broke down that prayer for you? That people say at night? Well, 
Some say when they're in trouble, or some say every morning, or some. God brings that peace. So I got that. I'm fine with the long suffering. If I, you know, no sinful lust, y'all know all of them. Kindness. You say you have love, joy, peace, long suffering, but then you are unkind to everybody you come upon. Think of that person you see that's supposed to that preach all day long about how they're a Christian and how they, you know, they the, they walk with the Lord and everything. The meanest person ever. You don't have kindness. That comes along with it. So y'all, you sure you walking in God's fruit or your own fruit? I'm not just, I'm just asking. Let me give you a second to think about that while I put my cleaning in. Okay. I can deal with it. Coffee kind of nasty, but that's why I don't like doing flavor coffees. I really like Columbia or Dark Roast. That's it. It's to the point now I don't even like flavor coffee. But I'm not going to let nothing go to waste because I got to do these videos. And I need to wake up. Back to the scripture. Okay, so along with kindness, you have goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. And for some people, a lot of these, okay, for some people, a lot of these are long-suffering because they can't keep doing these. So they're like, wait, I don't feel like being gentle today. I don't feel like being good today. I don't want to be faithful. And the faithfulness is the faithfulness with God. So if you already being unfaithful, unfaithful to your significant other, if you're in a relationship, if you already been unfaithful, you've already broke commandments. So you're not even in this fruit anyway. See, you're not even in this fruit. He's talking about the faithfulness with him okay so don't confuse all your scriptures so if you are walking in the fruit of the spirit of the lord then you have to have all of these not one or two but the good thing is i got some good news now you can mature in it see he don't expect you to just jump in and all of a sudden not do them all you mature in it. So you may be good right now in the love, the joy, and the peace. But you're having a little struggle with the self-control and the gentleness. Okay. So some of these, you mature in them. And that is your walk. See, it doesn't say, how can I put it? It says walk. You have to walk the path. Walk in a relationship with God. Grow and mature. It didn't say you went from a toddler and all the way to a grown up. So the good news is you can mature in others faster than you mature in some. But as long as you keep walking the walk, honey, as long as you keep. So start being in these fruits in yourself and if you're like me and you trying to make sure that you do what you need to do to save your soul and you're trying to do the right things and learn these scriptures and walk the path now i'm not a i'm i'm not a pastor i'm not i'm not please i'm just a person who is trying to do the right thing and if God laid it upon me to make this video then I'm doing the right thing so if you want those relationships that I read about on your inspiration board start with yourself build a relationship with someone higher than man get your inner self 
right and you'll see that person because you're missing them him or her walking right past you mm-hmm you too busy fruit of the spirit so remember that all right see i didn't keep you long i kept you long as i did a cup of coffee join me again you know it's every other wednesday bring your inspiration card let me know one that you put bye guys mm -hmm.